Hi, welcome back to my channel. It's Emily Lucy Ratch. If you're new here, I've got an Instagram account, a TikTok account, and a YouTube channel. So welcome if this is your first time. Please make sure you subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. And if you are regular, thank you so much for always tuning in and watching my videos. Today is very spring themed. I mean, I'm wearing baby blue, spring vibes, Beautiful, gorgeous spring flowers from my friends Marcus and Lorraine, which I had to include in this video because they are stunning. I've got my grapefruit candle on. Like, I just feel like spring has taken over my body. So, with that being said, today's video is a sponsored one by Ice Wait First. All of the items are spring vibes. Like, we are ready for the next few days. April the 12th is so close. I am my nails done my head done. like literally my roots right now look it is just a joke like i'm just excited that normality is slowly starting to come back in and obviously we need some fantastic spring vibe outfits to be able to do all these things so with that being said let's get going i'm going to show you right now what i've got to show you in this i saw it first spring haul <laughs> First, I've had an absolutely mega month for the spring dresses. I posted this video here and it has gone crazy on Instagram. It's had like over 2 million views. It's just absolutely sold out straight away in any mid size sizes because it's just been going crazy. Constantly, people are viewing that video. So, that's kind of been the inspiration behind this video because I want some really cute alternatives to that gorgeous dress they have said it hopefully will be coming back in stock that dress so i will make sure i let you guys know when it does come back in stock over on my instagram right what have i got down here first so first i got this cute dress to show you this one is in a size 12 and it is called the puff polka dot midi dress in white so if you do follow me on Instagram, you will have seen that I have posted this in the shorter version and said it is great for ladies with a bigger bust. Teamed up with a nice coat over the top and a bag to bring it all in at the waist and the bust area. So I wanted to try the longer version on because I know I've had so many DMs over the last few weeks of some ladies saying they love the idea of wearing a dress but they don't want to show their legs off or they don't want anything too short. So I've also incorporated quite a few of those ideas into this video and also on Instagram coming soon. So I'm going to try this one on for you now. I think it is mega cute and I absolutely love this polka dot design. I just think it's so gorgeous for spring. So. As you can see, I've styled this one with this belt to pull it in. This one is a 12 and I actually do think I need 10. It's just a little bit too big here. Um, and I like things to be quite fitted at the top here because obviously that makes it look less baggy, especially if you're a bigger busted lady, you want something that's gonna be like slightly tight fit in here and then bring you in at the waist. So I do think you need to size down on this one. It is very big on the sizing. And I've also put it with some different looks. One is like a very summer kind of vibe where you know you might be going to like some party or something. And then the other one is this one, which is with this jacket. Again, that's from I Sew It First, and it just works to kind of pull everything in and have a bit more of a conservative look. Where if you are someone that maybe perhaps isn't a person that wants to get their legs out in summer or feels like they don't like it too much on show but it's really hot, then a dress like this is actually perfect. I've also put the cycling shorts underneath this dress. So if you are someone that suffers with chafing and or you just hate being like too hot and your legs rubbing together, then this kind of dress is perfect because you can put the cycling shorts underneath and it will keep you nice and chafe free, but also work to pull your tummy in. It's a bit like shapewear really. So yeah, I actually really like this one for summer and it's perfect for anyone who wants a bit more of a conservative look. Okay, on the same vibe as that gorge dress is this one, which I'm wearing here. And this I have actually got because I wanted to add it to a video I'm working on, which is wedding guest videos. And this dress, I had to put it on, like I just absolutely love this color for spring. It's just stunning. So I'll quickly show you now what this dress looks like so you can actually see below here and how perfect the fit is. So as you can see, the dress is super flattering. It's a skater style, so it's really pulling me in at the waist here, but then floating down and really flattering this tummy area so you're gonna feel comfortable in it 
all day and then the detail on the sleeves is just super pretty as well that's why i just think this is such a nice dress for weddings or christenings or just some kind of like cute summer party um because the color is amazing and it's just so flattering and nice i just love this shade <laughs> we have this super cute polka dot skirt oh my gosh that is so cute <gasps> I'm so excited for summer. I actually had such a burst of excitement then because of this skirt. It's just so summer cute. So I'm going to try that one on for you now, maybe with like a little bodysuit or a shirt. I'm so into this like French Riviera vibe at the moment with the white shirt and the polka dots and the gold. I'm just, I just love it. I'm going to try that on for you right now. So the skirt I have teamed up with this white top and I've also put it with these little flip flops. Gone for a really summery vibe with these big black glasses like i said french riviera and i just love this skirt i think it's super comfortable and again it's quite long so you can actually put the cycling shorts underneath it if you wanted to, to prevent any chafing okay so if the dresses are a little bit too much out of your comfort zone then i've gone for a bit of a wild card but it's not a wild card i feel like this is like a comfortable spring look and that is some cycling shorts black cycling shorts i got these ones in a 14 I've got them in a 12 as well somewhere. But they're just like jersey cycling shorts, so they're like mega comfortable, really similar to what a pair of leggings would be like. And then I'm gonna put it with this super cute oversized jumper. Princess Diana vibe, white socks, white trainers, tanned legs, hair in like a cute ponytail or low bun with some gold earrings, and then this and the shorts, it's a vibe. I can imagine that being a really cute date if you're gonna go for like a walking date, like if you're gonna go in the river and you wanna have like a nice date and you wanna look cute, cycling shorts. It's like walkable, <laughs> you're not gonna get any chafing issues, your bones gonna look good and then you can have a baggy top in the jumper that's gonna make you feel comfortable so you can grab, you know, a little beer garden drink on the way, on the walk back, it's a vibe. So I'll try that one for you right now. So I've put this together with the white socks, the white trainers and some aviator sunglasses and a chain bag and I just think this look is just working together in a really cute way, it's stylish but it's also flattering because it's hiding any tummy area and the cycling shorts work to pull the tum in as well and it's just a really nice everyday spring look. Okay and to finish my pastel spring vibes I have got this little top which I'm just a sucker for this colour, I just love this, with white, with jeans, I just love this vibe, so I'm going to try this on. But then, if you're not too sure about having like a crop top, which to be fair, like I have to be in the mood for a crop top to be honest, because I'm 31 year old woman, there's a limit on when I can wear a crop top, but if it's a hot day, I just think, you know what, it's really cute, but if you wanted to not go for that vibe, I have gone for this bodysuit which is the same colour but obviously it is a bodysuit so we can see what the fit is like and you know that the lower tummy area is going to be hidden and you're going to feel more comfortable so I'll try both of those on now and compare and then I'll be back. Okay so this is the top it's actually super cute I haven't got any trousers on with it so I'm actually in my pants but it just comes to below my belly button so if I was wearing like high-waisted jeans I could definitely get away with it or even like high-waisted denim shorts I don't actually have any on me right now which is why I've not tried them on um for my set first but this is actually really cute and I love the colour so I'll definitely be getting this out and teaming it up with some different looks on my Instagram but yeah love this one and then again, I haven't got any trousers on with it. Um, but this is actually really, really cute. I love this colour and the fit is really good. This is the 14. And I do actually think I could probably have got away with the 12. It just depends how low cut you wanted it to be. Um, but personally, I like it to be a little bit tighter on the stomach area just so it pulls you in a little bit. But this is such a good summer staple to have and get out in spring and summer every single year. And... I just think it's such a nice colour and I love the design here. I think it looked really nice with, again, white shorts, white trousers. I on holiday, a really nice pair of white trousers or a white skirt. That Zara style of um, 
the like knot skirt would look amazing with this as well but yeah I'll definitely be getting this one out as well and posting it on Instagram very soon as soon as the weather comes okay so I hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for joining me and again if this is your first time please make sure you subscribe and give this video a thumbs up I mean I'm just excited by the next video I'm probably gonna have gone to at least three beer gardens <laughs> so I'm excited to go to the gym get my nails done, get my hair done, the roots are just wild and just have some normality and I know you guys are all in the exact same situation so we're happy. Spring is here, the Easter Bunny's been, bring in the great weather and I will catch you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching, speak to you soon, bye!